Hi, I'm Dr. Andy Thompson and I'm a rheumatologist. Today, I'm going to talk about abatacept for the treatment of inflammatory arthritis. You can visit our website www.rheuminfo.com and print off one of our abatacept picked up pamphlets to follow along with this video. Abatacept is also known as Arencia. Abatacept is given by an intravenous infusion once every four weeks. The infusions are given by a specially trained nurse at an infusion center. Now some people can feel better quite quickly after starting abatacept, but for others it can take a little longer. There are three things you need to do when taking abatacept. You should discuss these with your doctor. First, abatacept can make it slightly harder for you to fight off infections. You should stop taking abatacept if you develop a fever, if you think you have an infection, or if you're given antibiotics to treat an infection. Second, before starting abatacept, you should have a skin test and chest x-ray to make sure you've never had an infection called tuberculosis before. And finally, you should have occasional blood tests while taking abatacept to keep track of your arthritis. Abatacept can very rarely cause an allergic reaction during the infusion. These reactions usually aren't severe and you'll be closely monitored by a trained nurse. Abatacept should be stopped before surgery. It can be restarted once things have healed and there's no sign of infection. If you're having surgery, talk to your doctor about when to stop the medication. Abatacept hasn't been properly studied in pregnancy. Let your doctor know if you're pregnant, planning to get pregnant, or if you're breastfeeding. Abatacept can worsen symptoms of emphysema and make pneumonia worse. Tell your doctor if you have emphysema or COPD. And finally, medications like abatacept have been rarely associated with the development of cancer. Let your doctor know if you've had cancer before. If you're receiving abatacept, you should call your doctor if you feel sick and want to stop or if you're concerned about any side effects. For abatacept, there are other specific reasons to call your doctor. If you have a fever or think you have an infection, if you're planning surgery, if you're pregnant or planning to get pregnant, if you plan to get any vaccinations, or if you develop a rash. I hope you found this video to be useful. For more information, please refer to our website at www.roominfo.com.